Yes. Good morning, Southern California, AM 1220, KHTS. This is your host, Fred Arnold, on the Santa Clarita Valley Chamber of Commerce Business Spotlight. And I'm very proud to have Fast Frame and Randy Brzezinski. Yes. And uh, Randy, um, I I know, does a lot of work with the Chamber of Commerce, very involved with the Chamber of Commerce. Uh, Actually, uh, as a devoted, devout member of the Chamber of Commerce, a disciple, ambassador, you name it. Uh, So I'm very happy to have him on the show and highlight Fast Frames. So tell me about your your business. I know it's the it's the Randy and Rosemary show there. Basically, yeah, that uh, maybe Rosemary and Randy show half the time. But in fact, Rosemary would be here right now. She's at the store. <laughs> in fact, with Father's Day upon us and the Kings winning, the back room looks like a locker room right now. We've got jerseys all over the place, but it's a lot of fun. We we have a lot of fun. So we will frame literally anything and everything that we've uh, uh, can get our hands on. Literally, I've uh, framed uh, pictures of Carl Goldman that we won't talk about, of course, <laughs> as well as um, uh, all the way up to a really cool thing we did last year was uh, Muhammad Ali's uh, 1996 uh, Olympic torch. Wow. That, that was kind of a challenge. That was fun. Yeah, exciting stuff. And mm-hmm. the, the one thing that people don't get is when you buy something off the counter or over the counter from another possibly uh, chain store is you might not get the same protections and the same ability to preserve that piece. Tell us about some of the specific things you do to preserve pieces. Yeah, thanks for mentioning that, Fred. That's a really good thought because a lot of, we're, we're into what we call preservation and conservation. Now, that's a couple of things. One is the materials we use. Everything is acid-free, pH balanced, UV protected. Lots of different types of glass out there. All the glass we use is 99% UV protected. We have some reflection control museum quality materials really really important Uh, the other part is the procedures that we use Uh, there's lots of different procedures and techniques that we use that are somewhat what we call reversible Uh, then that last thing you want to do is have a nice diploma a nice master's degree uh, certification of some sort or a signed you know uh, again Muhammad Ali or any uh, sports memorabilia uh, dry mounted so it's permanently glued onto something that devaluates it and can degrade it over time tell me about some of the stuff you're working on now well, again, with uh, the Kings winning, we got jerseys g- galore in the background. Uh, Father's Day is here. Uh, a lot of uh, a lot of kids art. Kids art's really really cool. If you know, you, we all have some kids are laying around or running around, and uh, they're they're really really neat. The things that they can kind of do. They're very creative, very artsy, and uh, it's uh, fairly inexpensive to have some kids art done for Father's Day. So we've been, we've been doing a lot of that too. And you mentioned mm-hmm. the, uh, the Muhammad Ali torch in the past. Any other things that you've done in the past that are unusual people don't think about? Well, driving into the uh, uh, st- uh, station this uh, today, I know you had Sue Reynolds on the phone. Yes, or, uh, here as well, and uh, Sue actually she brought in a couple of cool things. She had a couple of nice little puppy dogs many years ago. Uh, Elswin passed away and she went out and uh, f- found a footprint in the uh, uh, mud. So she took her little um, uh, plaster of Paris and kind of made a nice little mold of it. And years later, uh, the little one went away too to have doggy heaven. And so she brought those in and we put those in a shadow box for her. So it's not just sports memorabilia. It's not just, you know, family photos. It's things that are really meaningful and again, we make them heirloom quality so they can keep them forever. And it's all about preserving, you know, preserving one's uh, identity and preserving one's memories and preserving one, uh, just everything, the essence of life. Yeah, we have a lot of folks that bring in a lot of vintage photos, you know, ancestry things uh, back in the 1800s. And these have to be handled very, very delicately and sensitively and in, in a very unique and special way. And they'll last forever. That's so. And Randy, uh, again, uh, everyone at the chamber knows how to get a hold of you and where you're located. But please share with the listeners and those actually watching this online. Yeah, we are located in the uh, Valencia Crossroads uh, Shopping Center. It's the Whole Foods Shopping Center right next to Kohl's. Uh, if you turn in by Islands. Well, there, Islands uh, Restaurant. Yeah, Islands Friday Night right, Islands for the family. Yeah, you turn in by Islands, go past Wahoos. There's a four-way circular stop sign that no one stops at. But if you look to your right, <laughs> we're right there. Oh, yeah, great. Yeah, we're here to serve. We, we're, we, we've been at this location for over four years. And again, we'd, uh, like I said, my wife would be here right now, but somebody's got to be there at the store yeah. taking care of business. Taking so, care of all yep, the customers. And it. phone number? Uh, 661, of course, here in the Valley. Uh, 291-1325. Again, 291 
one three two five. Of course, uh, you can find uh, find Randy on the in Fast Frame at uh, the Chamber website, scvchamber.com. Yes. So, uh, thank you for all you do for the Santa Cruz Valley Chamber of Commerce, all you do for our community, and uh, very excited and honored to have you on our show today. Thank you, Fred. Good uh, to thank be here. you. The Santa Cruz Valley Chamber of Commerce Business Spotlight on AM twelve twenty KHTS. Ladies, we need to talk. Frequent bathroom trips.